Ooh, that's really um, a loaded question. So there's there's a lot of things that I guess come to mind when you ask about the terms and conditions of an insurance policy from those policies that have a two year contestability period, which simply means in the first two years that if something happens, they will contest the validity of the passing or the, the incident that would ultimately cause the insurance company to pay out funds. Um, there's policies that have a two year graded or three, four year graded period, where in those first few years, the policy will pay back your premiums. Sometimes in addition to um, your premiums, they'll give you a 10% bonus, a 5% bonus, or within that time frame, they'll pay out a portion of the death benefit before the entire death benefit goes into force. Uh, and then there's things as simple as with your term policies, I guess terms and conditions would be uh, those, those stipulations of that defined term and what happens at the end of the term. If there's a, a renewable cause without having to requalify for insurance, guaranteed insurability, or um, if there's a conversion uh, ability where you can convert from that term policy to a whole life policy. Also, when we talk about terms and conditions, I think about universal life policies or any policy, a whole life policy, anything that accumulates cash value in the terms and conditions surrounding how they actually accumulate cash value, how the money is separated when you pay your premium and the different things that go into um, those calculations where your accumulation is concerned. So uh, there's really a lot a lot that comes into consideration when we talk about terms and conditions surrounding insurance, partly because it, it varies so widely and, and mostly in part to the fact that insurance is one of the most highly regulated industries um, in this country. So terms and conditions is, is essentially what the insurance industry is made up of. So um, yes, there's a ton of terms and conditions associated with life insurance. It just depends on how deep you want to go and exactly which lane or what type of policy um, it is that you're inquiring about. But um, those will all be discussed between you and your financial professional when you find out, hopefully it's me, when you try to figure out what the best fit is for you. But you definitely wanna make sure that you walk away from that table fully understanding what it is that you purchase because more often than not, when it comes time to utilize that, you won't be here and you want your family to be taken care of in the capacity that you saw fit when you put that policy in place. So I hope that answers your question. If not, you know where to find me.